Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Jack, and welcome back to Summer Nightmare. So, let me click load for a second. So it gets back to here. Okay, so. We left off at this drawer. And it was like candy wrappers or sticky notes or something. Sir. Okay. Notes? Hmm. What does it say? It looks rather strange. Perhaps it's a message from the principal. The feed is prepared. Status check. 12, 10, 14. Forbid access to the basement. October 14th? That's yesterday. What kind of order is it? It is. That's not good English. It, that's not good English. Okay. There are other files underneath the note. It looks like the it looks like a file that conveys the identities of researchers. That's a lot of researchers. Or a lot of gum. I still say it's gum. Probably. I still say it's gum. The nurse. These are all sc our school's faculties. Teachers were involved in the research institutes too. I couldn't understand a thing. It feels as if something's disturbing my thought process. Uh, what is it? Teacher! You guys are all here. What happened to you guys? Uh, Oscar began to talk about what has happened so far. The teacher's face, began, face turned serious as he listens to the story. Yeah, the thing that happened the last episode where we found, like, the dead bodies in the cafeteria and the girl with the eye, with the no eyes. Yeah, that, is that, is that what you're talking about? Yeah, see, he's all surprised. Huh. <laughs> when Oscar finished the story, the atmosphere of the school office turned heavy. Well, no duh. <laughs> I would think so. The teacher roughly swept down his face and began to talk. At this point, I'll tell you everything. The fact is, our school was... School was what? Oh, it's the principal. Is this like a flashback or something? Maybe? I have a very bright office. Hey, Mr. Kim. This is how you handle things at work? Oh, his name is Mr. Kim. He doesn't look like a teacher, though, to be honest. It's very bright for a teach For a, uh... Okay. <laughs> Somebody reported that they have they heard a pounding noise from the first floor. What's going on? You still couldn't have th have it under control. That's I can't control the Medusa. That's why I locked it in the basement. Hold up. You're in charge of the Medusa? What the heck? But why? Hold on. It's not what I wanted. Why is it being weird? Sorry. Okay. There, now you can see, you actually see my cursor. But yeah, you're under the thing of my the Medusa thing? You're in charge of that? That's unsettling. Okay. Well, at least, the least you could do is not make it so obvious. With two question marks, two exclamation points. You're right. I have nothing to say. Are you even feeding it properly? You feeding it? Are you the one killing all the kids? Right now, all I, all I give is all we give is pork, but that won't be enough. Mr. Kim, haven't I told you to change its food? But boss, I mean principal, that's, that's, don't talk back and do as I say say why don't you start with students from your class you're turning your your employer employees into murderers sir and you look creepy but sir i can't do that now you're wash you're washing hands off now you're you're washing hands off i admit our experience wasn't e ethical but it brought us where we are to where we are today to cover it up we xx group built a school here it's too late 
to just step out of this. If you tried to run away, we would have to kill you and your family. What? Like a like a cult or something? What the heck? This is too bright. I'm afraid to mess with something. Otherwise, it's gonna close this probably. He's not happy. Yeah, I wouldn't be too happy either. I hope you understood what I said. Go ahead and do what I asked. Yes, sir. Jeez, controlling much? We were the researchers at the XX Research Institute, and the principal was our boss. Why are you letting him do that? Why did you, why did you, did you apply to this job? Were you forced into this job, maybe? Did, why would you do that? <laughs> After the school was built, we, he tried to shut, uh, shut down, make, he tried to make us be, make us quiet and hired us as teachers to take care of the Medusa. We were forced to do it. Anyways, because basically we were threatened by the principal and followed his order. So you murdered children? Oh my gosh. So, the nurse too? Right, she was a re researcher too. I can't believe something like that was happening in our school. Yet the principal accused me of murder? The principal accused you of murder? I thought it was like the other teachers like him. I feel so guilty that I can't do anything about this. I should have stopped the principal at all costs. But then he would have killed you and your family, and I don't think that's a good idea. Oh, no, he's crying. He's so sad. Oh. I'm so sorry for the dead students. Oh, he's so, cr he's so sad. He still doesn't look like a teacher, though. Teacher, you were also forced. The principal is to blame. If only I knew how terrible he was. Are you like the te principal's pet, like the teacher's pet kind of thing? Like, are you, did you work in the office? Thank you for telling me that, but I bear the responsibility also. Let me tell you how to get to the basement. The entrance, why would you want to go into the basement? That's where the Medusa is. Well, no, actually, the Medusa is everywhere. But mainly the basement. The entrance to the basement is behind the bookshelf in the principal's office. Let's go there. We headed to the principal's office with the homeroom teacher. Here, behind the bookshelf. That bookshelf? Oh, wait, is that that bookshelf? Uh. As the homeroom teacher pulls out the bookshelf, a small door appears. This is the door that leads to the basement? I bet Lino's there is also there. Let's go. Or the teacher killed her. Like, there's a possibility of that, too. Because, like, he said that he killed the students in order to feed the Medusa. So it's possible that maybe he killed her in order to feed her to the Medusa. So that's a possibility. Keep that in mind. So, yes. Okay. Wait a second. Look outside. Is the principal there? Uh, a red shadow emerges on the other side of the window. Medusa is already... We have to hurry. Medusa's coming! No, if we go down there, they'll, we'll get caught right away. Maybe it's better to escape to the principal's room. Lena is there alone. We have to go... We have to go there. But you don't even know if she is there. You just assume that she's there, because that's the only place you haven't checked. Oscar intervened to stop our argument. Be quiet, everyone. Just go get in, just get in here for cr for crying out loud. I don't think that's what they're saying. I will stop that monster. Go ahead and find a way to save Lena and to all of us. Is she gonna sacrifice herself? You still look very scared. But I have to pay for what I did. Teacher, we haven't got the time for this. Hurry up. Teacher, we will be back soon. Please stay safe. You guys too. I knew I shouldn't have trusted the teacher, though. I knew that was a bad idea. We opened the door and began to enter one by one. Trey, aren't you coming in? I'll stay here and help our teacher. I'm the class rep after all. Just because you're the class rep doesn't mean you have to die. Jeez. With your teacher. All right. Please be careful. Thanks. Leaving Trey and the homeroom teacher behind, we headed... Bad. We headed to the basement. I hope everyone is safe. 
music's very loud. Sorry, it's dark. Because this is dark. It's time to save Lena. The door led us to the basement. I relied on a small light. It came down to the town to a ladder. Oh, nice. Yeah, you changed the scenery from the, uh, ba the hallway to a basement. It's dark and stinks. Jane grabbed grabbed her nose. The foul, foul smell, stench, whatever, same thing, hit us. It is the smell of rotting corpses. Well, of corpses rotting. Well, that's lovely. That's that's great. Don't you love that in the morning? Wook. <laughs> the basement is dark and wet. Great. We can't do anything but wait. Until we get used to the darkness and figure out how to where the smell came from. Uh, dead bodies. Yeah! I'm guessing that's a scream. Oh, that's lovely. I'm guessing that's the bully. That's the bully. Uh, well, that's another. That's great. That's a lovely picture. Nice. Okay. <laughs> After being accustomed to the darkness, we saw mute, mute, mutilated body parts. Jane screamed at, and collapsed. You can't pass out in here, are you crazy? That is kind of gross, though. Is that like, is that a brain or is that like his intestines or something? They are, they're our classmates. Uh, well, yeah, I would think so. What's the point of cutting off the limbs if it's just gonna cut off the heads anyway? The bodies of the missing students, we're all here. But where's Kai? However, the last victim, Kai, is missing. Well, duh, Jane will shiver in fear. While shivering in fear led the way, I thought she collapsed. Doesn't that mean you pass out? Let's go inside. I don't want to be here any longer. Oh, that's lovely. That's what you want to see. I found a door deep inside the basement. Why is there a room in the basement? Maybe it's a finished basement. You have no idea. Let's go inside. Chamber torture knife to place. Nice. Awesome. Chamber torture not good. <laughs> uh, what is this place? Do you not really- Wait, I feel like- Yes, I get it. It's all blood and it's gore and it's gross and everything. But shouldn't you at least try to keep it clean? So you don't need, like, tetanus shots and stuff? I would think that mur murderer people would be more clean. But that's just me, I guess. I would think that they'd be cleaner. And just have blood everywhere. Look at, look at the, this is not needed up here on the cabinet too. Like that's gonna take. That's not coming out. Like on your hardware tools, stuff like that. I took the lead, the lead, and opened the door. However, did you get locked out? Huh? The moment I came in, the door closed. Inevitably, inevitably, Jane and Oscar had went wait had to wait outside. It is a laboratory. It's a bit weird. Wait, so they're out there and you're, I'm in here by myself? It is room, it, it is a room seemed like a laboratory. One weird thing was that every, everything here was covered in red. Well, no duh, it's blood. Yeah, it seems, it seems to be blood. Moreover, the room is filled with jars that contain body organs. Is that what these are? Or those? Either way. Yeah, ew. <laughs> Real frowned upon the disturbing view. And you're crying. Yeah, I would think that that'd be terrible, terrifying. How do you not have any blood on your- Oh, wait, oh, you have some on your hands, I guess. Oh. Oh, is that? Is there someone in this room? I hear a sound somewhere. Thanks. Following the sound, I went deeper in the room. Don't follow sounds in a creepy, haunted-looking, Medusa-filled area. It is a prison. Why is there a prison? Lena! Is it? Lena was locked in a jail with an iPad and a gag? What? I have to free her, but the door is locked. It seems. Is that this? It seems like you have to unlock the lock device. Unlock a lock device to open it. Let's find the key to the room. Okay, let's quick save. Okay, open the drawer. Or open the big pot. Let's open the big pot, maybe. 
Why is there a pot here? Whoa. Hold up. Okay. <laughs> the pot kind of seemed out of place. Let's see. Should I open it? Uh, maybe you shouldn't have opened it? Kai. That's Kai. Okay. Why is Kai's body here? Why is any of their bodies here? Put the pieces together. Every part of his body except for the, the face was mangled horribly. Was Kai another victim of the principal's plan? Well, probably. Huh? Kai is the son of the principal? Wait a second. You're friends with the principal's son, but you didn't know that the principal was part of this whole thing? Why would he kill his son? Why would he do such a horrible thing to his son? Just why? That is a good question. Also, how did you not know about his dad's plans to kill everyone? Somebody screamed outside. It's Jane's scream. I left the room hastily. Luckily, the door opened from outside. Oh, I didn't even get to go through and open the drawer. Trey, what are you doing? Is Trey kill- <gasps> Is he un in on it because he's the class rep? They Trey grabbed Jane's neck and threatened her with a knife. Oh no! Oscar! What's Trey doing? Jane is in danger! Crazy person. Oh, I got on team. I didn't read it. Yeah, I might be crazy. Yeah, I might be crazy. But who wouldn't turn crazy in a situation that I'm in? What situation are you in? I feel like the sun would go crazy. If he didn't die, I feel like this would be him. What? You guys are selfish. There he goes again. What the heck are you talking about? You can live on every uh, after the night ends but i i will banish i won't let this night end i will reign here i will reign here forever stop ruining my plan is it your plan when you when then you knew everything then you knew everything yeah the principal is behind all of this you would all know that the principal was the president of the xx group i don't want to die i will live here forever the HR teacher, could he be? By now, he's probably been eaten mercilessly. Well, that's great. You crazy? This is not good for anyone. Please stop. It's a shame you ended up this way. Ended up that way. If you really feel sorry for me, get out of get out of that room at once. This is an order, not a request. If you key, if you give up everything ending about give up if you give up about ending this night i'll let this girl go trey seems like he really gonna stab you no not gonna stab her more like slit her throat but okay <laughs> what should i do oh no loading will no it's not what i wanted that would have been bad try to talk it out enter the room and lock the door that would kill all of them in there okay I'm gonna go with try to talk it out, maybe. You don't have to do this. You better make a quick decision. I tried to change Trey's mind, but it did not seem to work. The sh red shadow started to come from behind. It's the Medusa. The first time I uh, felt food, felt food that the Medusa was coming. Oscar and I looked at each other's eyes and we nodded as if we were we, could, we agreed on something. Jeez. Hey Trey, this isn't this is that's. Isn't that our teacher behind you? That's awkward voice. Isn't that our teacher behind you? That awkward, vo that awkward voice of Oscar made me cringe. Wait, <laughs> what kind of idiot would fall for that, huh? Wait, what? Oscar said something about Oscar. What? But how? He should be dead. Ah. Uh. Trey looked back after hearing what Oscar said. Jane, Oscar, get in here quick. Lee. What? I successfully entered the room with Oscar and Jane. I hurried and closed the door. Is this a this is a different room? And there's more blood. <laughs> and that looks like it should be like a like a zap like a ex like an electric chair. Okay. Trace seems to be screaming outside. Before Medusa gets here, we have to end everything and save Lena. 
Look at the bed. What's with them taking their- this looks like a lion's face. But what's with them taking their faces? Okay. There's a bed in the center of the room. There was not. On the bed, there was a body of a woman. Well, a girl, because this is cool. Oh, she's bruised, too. That's nice. That's lovely. Okay. She still has no face. I don't know how her head is staying up like that. She must have been one of the victims of the Medusa experiment. What a tragedy. I feel like you're not supposed to be here. The face of the woman was demolished at the point of impossible to identify. Well, yeah, it's completely gone. Like, her entire face is gone. Let's cover her face. Yeah. Put the blanket. Yeah, just her face. Just her face. Took Jean's suggestion and covered the woman's face with a white cloth. Not the whole thing, just her face. Rest in peace. Hope you're in a better place. I said nothing. Suddenly, the ground started to shake. I could not stand on my own. I grabbed the doorknob and shake. To the shaking started to seize. What the heck was that? And there's see, there's no there's no table in the middle of this room, unless it's like off to the side or something. Lena, the shaking stopped completely, and I unlocked the door, and the locked door opens. I helped Lena move carefully and open the door to, for, with other students. Wait. Ah, uh, the light is coming in. The night is over. The morning is coming. Everything is over. Is it, though? <gasps> Wait, she's not hurt at all. Come on, Rail. We'll be late at this rate. Like for what? School? Oh, you ended up together. Nice. After that, tra I thought you were dead. <laughs> Rail, how are you? You guys are always together. Are you really dating now? Hold up. I thought you guys all died. Don't say that. Lena, let's get to class. Don't make noise in the hallway and go to the classroom straight away. I thought the bullies died. Or wait, that was just my assumption. <laughs> I just assumed that they died. After the night ended, everything went back to, into place. The principal was is being investigated by the police with the uh, with the evidence that I found in the basement. Our HR teacher has passed away that day. Oh, he passed away that day. And everyone in the school commemorates him with respect. Everything revealed and resolved. Oh, he died. He saved people, kinda. He slowed it. He slowed Medusa down. That saved people. Even though Trey kind of died anyway. Now I must go back to, to my life too. I wonder though, did the principal go so far as to kill his own son? Are you never going to figure that out? Wait, is that it? Wait. No. Okay. I'm going to end this here. And then I'm going to make another video about the other choices that I could have made. So... Uh, the the two other choices that I that I missed, or three other choices. You know, you know, I'll I'll figure it out when I when I get there. But um, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to become part of my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.